Hi, my name's Paul Norford. I'm a regional product manager with Zebra Technologies. Today, I just want to walk through some of the additional accessories that we have with the ET5. As you can see here, to my left, I've got the eight inch unit, and on the right, I've got the 10 inch unit. The eight inch unit doesn't have the rugged frame. On the back, I've got the expansion back, and this is the expansion back with the uh, SE 4750 imaging engine. We'll talk through that in another video in a while. But here, this is the 10 inch unit. This has the rugged frame around it. It also uh, comes with the, uh, the expansion back, which is just behind. Another accessory is the optional battery. It's a smart battery. You can see if I push the button on the back, you can just see uh, an, uh, an indication as to how much charge is left in the optional battery. If ever you're caught short, you can always charge it via the micro USB connector that we have on the device. If we then plug this into the bottom of the 10 inch unit, you'll hear it click twice. If I then turn it around, you may just be able to see uh, here, just on the left-hand side, the battery indicator that has come up. If we have a quick look at the docks, we do two docks. This is the rugged dock to be used with the rugged frame because that also has the rugged IO connector that's at the bottom, and that gives you full comms. These two large pins here are the charge pins. This is the non-rugged dock, and as you can see here, this has got a port as opposed to the pogo pins. Again, these two long pins at the side here are the charging pins. It also means that with one dock, you can charge both the eight and the 10 inch units, but just make sure if you have the rugged frame on with the rugged IO that you select the rugged dock, which is here. This will also give you comms via the pogo pins. For further information and more details on some of our accessories, please do visit our website at zebra.com for additional details.